help you with something? I need a detective. Then you'll come to the right place. Pearl Bradford, detective at large. I'm Sylvia Chandler. Chandler, Miss Chandler, would you like to have a seat, please? What kind of case is this? Yeah, uh, can my secretary get you maybe a hot cup of coffee? Hmm? No. Thank you. No? Well, it's... Perhaps you want us to follow Exactly us how can I be of assistance to you? I'm rather embarrassed about coming. No, 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 don't worry about that. I assure you, whatever you share with me will be held in the strictest of competences. I didn't know where else to turn. Mm -hmm. Someone trying to kill you? Go on, Mrs. Chandler. It all started some time ago, and it's been getting worse for the past few months. It's my husband. He's acting very strangely. He disappears for hours at a time, and he's aloof around the house. I even followed him when he goes out at night. Now, I've never actually caught him. I think he's got a mistress. I love him so much, I just didn't want to believe it for the longest time. It hurts me to even think it. Uh, look, Miss Chandler, I... I've made some notes. Mm-hmm. This is the patterns of where he seems to go. I think this could help you and the habits that he's acquired lately. Uh, and I have a picture of him right here. Oh, that's very nice. I, I really wish that we could help you here. But you see, at this agency, we have a strict policy about not dealing in this kind of thing. That's Pearl, all. that's but, crazy. I know if I explain Mrs. Chandler's problem to Cruz, he'd make an exception. I'm sorry. It's an ironclad law. No way do we get involved in this stuff. But there is an agency down the street that... Uh, <laughs> Last resort. Yes, Mr. Altman, he's here. Just won't I'm very sorry. I have to get that in the in the outer room. But th this place down the street would be more than happy to take care of this business for you. It was very nice of me to you. Mm -hmm. Mrs. Chandler, Cruz Castillo is my brother, and he's the best private detective in Santa Barbara. I know. That's why I came here. I don't want to go to some cheap agency and have some sleazy man follow my husband around. Well, I'm afraid Mr. Bradford's very strict on our rules, but if you give me the notebook, I'm sure I can put in a good word with my brother. I would be so grateful. You don't know how long it took me just to work up the nerve to walk in here. Well, you don't have to worry about that. Don't worry, we'll help you. Thank you for talking to Mr. Castile for me. I'll keep in touch. <laughs>